What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. It is 6pm on Monday and today guys, the Icon SBC is expired. And so we are extremely hopeful that there is going to be some new Icon SBCs. There's nothing in objectives yet, sometimes it comes late. There's no Icon SBCs. There is a Wendell um, What If card, another left back, another... Bundesliga left back. I I don't know why EA do this. Like, why make Sink Craven and then Wendell? Like, why not just make it a right back or something? You know, we already have team of the year Alfonso Davies. Very peculiar. However, four star skill moves, three star weak foot, 95 acceleration, quite nice passing for a fullback, quite nice dribbling as well for a fullback, really good defensive stats, and really good physicals as well. Um, and of course, if Bayer Leverkusen get one clean sheet in the next five league games, he'll move up to an 88, which will be very nice. So I don't mind this at all. Um, I don't mind this at all. But how expensive is it going to be? Before I look at this, I haven't looked at the first one yet. I think this should be an 83 and an 84 at most. So it is an 83 with the Brazil player, which is nice. Knowing it, it's going to be an 86 as well, isn't it? That's an 85. So it's just a bit expensive again. Um, an 85... With a Bundesliga player, 70 chemistry and 83. 83 would be nice and easy to put together. So it's going to come in at about, what, 100k or something like that. Uh, it's not bad. It's not bad, especially if he goes up to an 88. Um, we'll have a look at his in-games and such in just a second. So I can't believe there's no icons. The what-if challenge was already there. The UEFA for marquee matchups was already there. This what-if challenge is new, but it is for an untradeable pack. 70 rated, 85 chemistry, 5 rares, 2 golds, same league, minimum 3. Fair enough, but it's for an untradeable pack, so a bit boring on that one. Is that, is that it for today from EA? I really think it is. Oh, ooh, mid or prime icon player pick. Oh, that's new. Why, th why this? Four segments on this. Is it repeatable? It's not repeatable. It's expensive. It's very, very, very expensive. Two 85s, an 86, and an 87, including four informs altogether. That's crazy. Now, the chemistry is quite low. We're going to go ahead and do it here, because why not, right? But uh, I don't know, man. For me, that's a bit savage. Uh, let's pop Mbappe in there. Benzema can go in there. I don't want to get too caught up with too many high rateds. Put some of the 80, uh, 87s in there. Chica Kalor Navas in there. Some 86 and some 85s can go in as well. We've got, we got plenty of fodder in this club, which is nice. Player picks were cracked with icon swaps. I just, I just don't know why EA do what EA do, you know? I really, really, really get confused sometimes by this company. I, I genuinely can't for the life of me, explain why there is no Icon SBCs. It's just, it's, there's just no reason behind it. Um, let's go, needed an 86 left back from Leverkusen. <laughs> did, did you? Uh, right, so we are 87 rated already. I assume that we can come down a fair bit. Right, the 40 chemistry is there. Come down with him. Can't come down with him. Can you check objectives? I looked at objectives. There wasn't anything there, my man. We can come down with him. I think that's going to be it, isn't it? That's the first segment done for a prime mixed players pack. I, d I don't need that Mbappe, guys. I have team of the year Mbappe on this account. It's a, it's a, it's a pointless card for me. Now, now it's going to get a bit tricky. The chemistry is really low, which is really nice from EA. But an 86 rated squad with a team of the week player is not very good at all. And Babu will get upgraded on Wednesday then. Um, right, we'll start with the Neuer. And we'll pop some 87s in. Maybe an 88 in there as well. Oh, let, let me put an Edison in as well because we've got two Edisons. Got a load of 88s as well. I do need an inform now. A couple more 87s. Now we can get get away with super low cards from here on in. Put Carver Howell in. I don't want to use that Delaney. Don't mind using Rui Patricio. 
This is only an 86 rated squad, so we can get away with plenty of lower rated cards. Could even use that Deli Alley. He's untradeable. It's likely I'll pack him again. Got some 84s in there. All right, so this is 80. Wow, this is only eight, oh, 85 rated because now we're 87 rated. Let's get rid of Di Maria. That's 86 rated. Let's get rid of Handanovic. Still 86 rated. That's madness. That's still 86 rated. That is truly madness. I think that's uh, that's all right, that. Pop him over there. Let's pop those two around like that. Pop him in there. Um, let's pop these two guys around. Uh, let's get Sancho over at... What do I want? Let me, let me get another like 84 rated card or something. Hey, Cody, thanks for the stars, man. Um, let's go gold. Just pick up a couple of the lower rateds. Izzy, Oyarzabal, and Jesus Navas would be good. Let's go with uh, Jesus Navas at right mid. That will get us some chemistry at the very least. Oyarzabal. Okay, he fits as well. That's crazy. What about an 85 over an 87? Okay, that's not enough. What about an 85 for an 86? That's not enough either. So this is the perfect setup. So if we just swap these two around here, that gets us 40 chem. Sancho in there will get us a bit more chem as well. Sané in there gets us a bit more chem as well. And we can actually put him in there, can't we? I suppose if we put Onana down there. There we go. That's the extra chem. Like that. There we go. So that's the second one done. Small rate mixed players pack for that one. Um... Wendell, yeah, Wendell being Brazilian certainly helps, but it could have just been anyone, couldn't it? Right, now we need an 85-rated squad, but with two in forms. At least it's a 4-4-2. It's not a, bad, uh, not a bad formation. Now, we'll start off again with one of the higher-rated cards just to get the rating kicked in straight away. Um, let's pop two of the higher-rated cards in. We need two in forms. Let me go and get two in forms that are going to work nicely together. Vasquez is nice. And Allaire will work as well because he's French, so links to a lot of players. All right, so now let's just go to the La Liga and see if we've got some good players here. Fodder, yeah, Fodder, well, I don't know if Fodder will go wild off of this because I think this is wildly too expensive. I think a lot of people won't even have the Fodder for this or even try or care for it because it is, like, crazy expensive, you know? This is, this is like, pushing that level of, like, is it worth it kind of expensive for a player pick that's only a mid or a prime. Now, if it was a prime or a moments, I'd be sitting here saying, okay, Fodder's going to go through the roof. But for a mid or a prime, now obviously you're going to get, what is it? What was it? Three player picks there? That's not bad, right? Three rated. There's 85 rated. Happy days. And then one more 85 rated squad again, this time with one team of the week player. And just so expensive. Let's go and have a look at what the best team of the week player is, and then we'll do the league around it. Um, let's use Keen. And we'll go for the Premier League. I've got some higher rated Premier League cards. And we've got like the 87s, like Loris and um, Aubameyang and whatnot. Fabinho's all right. Thiago. Oh, where were these? Arte, Tellez, Azpili, Willy, and Ndidi. Dave in there, Tellez in there. We only need a little bit of chemistry. Keep going. Um... Fabinho and Thiago should make this very easy. And the chem I mean the chemistry is wildly there, isn't it? Let's go and get some other higher lower rateds. I know tradable's off. Um I know tradable's off. We should be alright with these. Might even be able to bring it down a bit or two. Is it worth at least? I, I think that this is way too expensive. Um like, honestly. 85, can we bring an 84? Oh, yes. An 84 for an 85? No. 
All right, there we go. So a mid or prime, as I say, if this was a prime or prime moments player pick pack, it'd be a bit different, wouldn't it? But a prime or mid, now let's hope that we get something good. Can we get something good, EA? Come on. No, we can't. We've literally got three defenders. I don't even think these are... I th I th I'm pretty sure these are three mids, aren't they? It's <laughs> so Ashley Cole is his mid, and it's worth 320,000 coins. Zanetti is his mid, and it's worth 370,000 coins. And Fernando Hierro is his mid and is worth 230k coins. Three mids, three defenders, all of them worth... I, th I think if I could take all three of these at once, it would still be an L. I reckon, I, I reckon it could be like, hey, man, we felt bad, have all of them. I still th I think that would be an L. I'm going to say Ashley Cole because he's ex-Arsenal. But that is shocking. That is absolutely shocking. We've got some of the... Uh, I can't even remember what packs it was. Let's go and look at the... Uh... I've got a mid-icon pack as well. So we'll open this too. Um, this is probably going to be better. A walkout at least. Jesus, didn't even think I'd get a walkout of that after that, that before. German, CDM. Oh, this is going to be good, isn't it? Is that Philip Lahm? It is. That is. Hey, listen. That's not bad. 1.3 million coins there on him. So a player pick pack was way worse than his Philip Lahm. Lothar Matthias would have been nice, yeah. Rare mixed players pack. I don't even, like, I'm, I'm super, super disappointed with that. Like, it's what is it? It's like 800, 900k for the Icon SBC. The Wendell is there. We're going to go and have a look at Wendell. Sod packs, man. We can't we can't look at packs. So Wendell is coming in 25k and it's gonna be like what? It's actually gonna be expensive for an A5. It's gonna be over a hundred thousand coins for this card. Compared to his 77, they've given him 13 pace, 12 defending, 10 physical, 10 passing, 9 dribbling, 9 shooting. Obviously, he's got decent skill moves and weak foot. He kind of needs the upgrade. You know, it it's mid-tier dribbling. Let, let, I want to compare him. To Sink Raven. Another, like, why? Why? I just don't understand. Right? They, they could have picked anybody. Anybody at all. You could get Sink Raven from playing the game, just gameplay only. Wendell's going to be like 100 to 140k. And he has got the same passing. Worse shooting, worse dribbling, worse pace. Two more defending and six more physical, which is quite nice. He's got the same skill moves and the same weak foot. He's got the same work rates. He's the same height. They've literally just gone. We need a what-if card. Copy-paste St. Graven and just change his name. Wait, 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 just, uh, yeah, make... Just, I don't mind that it's by Leverkusen at all, but just make it any other bloody player. Why a left back? Why have we got two special left backs that are the same card from the same club? Diaby's cool. Fradecki is cool. Sink Raven and Tap Sober are cool. Bellarabi is cool. Bailey is cool. Look, look at just, just make it. Look at who they could have made it. Arangiz would have been super. Bender. They're retiring the Bender brothers after this season. M make make it this Bender card with like eighty pace. Arias would have been super cool. Um, Demir Bay would have been super cool. Tar would have been brilliant. That that way you could have the two centre backs, the left back, the left mid. Like you, you could actually put together like a really cool um, by Leverkusen squad. But instead, because the lack of left backs in the game, plus some people didn't do Sink Raven. Does that mean that for the rest of the game cycle, Felix, we're just going to get Bundesliga players for people that missed out on all these other Bundesliga players? It's the same as Bellarabi. Who who did they put out that was a carbon copy of Bellarabi? I can't remember his name. Who was the right mid that they put out? It was not Zinchenko. 
Who was the other one? I can't remember who it was. Chat will let me know in any second now. Herman the German. Oh, it's her. Man. Basically the same card. Just months apart. Months apart. Not even that one. It's the other one that we want. I've managed to pick the same one twice. That's pretty cool. Yeah, th this this one here anyway. Two less pace, same dribbling, more physical, more shooting, a little bit less. Pass. It's it's just it's just lazy at this point, isn't it? It's just lazy. These these two are like the same card. This one was released months later. <laughs> I'm beaten. I'm beat. I'm, I just. Oh God, they could have picked anyone. 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 Anyway, Wendell is coming in at 200,000 coins. Is an 85 rated squad that expensive, actually? I, don't, I didn't think it was. I can't even check the icons anymore to see. I thought an 85 rated squad was a bit cheaper than that. It's a million coins for the prime icon pack and it is 100... Oh, my days. What are they doing? What are they... Honestly, what are they doing? This player pick icon SBC is so, so overpriced. I literally could have had all three icons that were offered to me and I would have still been short on if I just bought them from the market. And then they've released a carbon copy SBC. Oh man, I'm sad guys. I'm not going to keep going on about it. I'm just sad. Be sad with me or be happy. Either way, I'm sad. I think that's terrible content. I'll see you guys for the next video, but I'm out. Peace.